everything should be good. I checked everything. I checked everything, everything. Okay? Oh my god. So, okay, can I just stop fondling over everything? English. Oh, uh, we're gonna be doing this, this fine chap right here. Yeah. <laughs> I was, I was wondering for a sec, I was like, what about, what if I do do, what if I do the girl character, by the way? What if I just like that one? I don't know, I like the girl characters in Pokemon more. Yes. Can you, can you change your gender in, in the game after you've already, hold on. The only thing you can't change after you start Pokemon skin tone. Uh, whatever, whatever. I'll just I'll just do the regular dude then. <laughs> I'm just all like, but I like seeing a girl character though. I'm like, ah, uh, whatever. I guess okay. Oh, what's this? So, keep in mind, I have like... Like, I love Pokemon. I love Pokemon so much. But I've never really fully played a Pokemon game ever. Welcome one and all to the wonderful world of Pokemon. Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon in which we share our lives. As you know, our society... <laughs> we live in a society. <laughs> As you know, our society is able to thrive. Oh, I've never seen that one before. Thanks to the help of these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon are all around us. In the sea, in the sky, even with us in our own towns. and those who choose to raise them and train Pokemon to do battle and compete. We call Pokemon Trainers. Yeah, Pokemon Trainers. Oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Rose, and it is a pleasure to be here. Now turn your gaze to Galar Region's greatest Pokemon Trainer, your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's Exhibit match I can't read that word sorry look it's a dude everyone loves dude looks like when I freaking accidentally say okay to what to wear what I'm picked out in Animal Crossing it's like do you want to wear what you just picked it's like oh okay and I'm like wait no wait exhibition or not Leon will promise record right just I don't know you know I don't lose battles Ryan Charizard, Dynamax. Oh my god! It's happening! The Joy-Cons are rumbling. I'm a dragon now, but not really. Pokemon Sword. I wanted to play Sealed because it had that one, that one female gym leader that everyone loves, except not everyone. I love her. It's the ice one. But, I mean, Pokemon Sword would probably get more views anyways than Sealed, so... Whatever. I guess, yeah. Can't, can't win them all. Look, it's me. That's what my hair looks like when, I'm, when my hair's shorter, honestly. It's really funny. Like, right after I get a haircut. Hop. Hello, hello. Oh, I can lower my chair now. Oh my god, did, did Wooloo just, like, roll in? Oh, that your flash new phone, Beth Moth? Did they talk like with a British accent? Were you watching Lee's exhibition match at, and wait, match on it? But you can't cheer him on with your hands full. You know, the only way the proper cheer on Lee would be his famous Charizard pose. Oh, they do talk with, with British dialect. Like, the way they talk. Hop, didn't you expect to see, wait, didn't expect you to, blah. I can't read. Ah, didn't expect to see you here today, Thier. 
Is it today the big day? Or is this the big day? Yeah, that's exactly why I came running over to get Bethmoth. Never mind watching the match now. I've got re I've got a recording at home anyway. I record all my brother's matches. Oh, that's your brother? Woo. Come with me. He said, wait, ah, I didn't read it. <laughs> Why'd I click it? And Lee always brings presents when he visits. So I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Now I've got to run. See you later. Wait, see you at mine later. God, I cannot read. Sometimes I flawlessly read. Sometimes it's like, eh. Is it gone? All right, here we go. Oh, I'm so fast. Holy crap. Wah! Strike a pose. Whoosh. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. I'm not even joking. Like, that's literally what my hair looks like when it's shorter. I'm, I'm dead serious. It clearly doesn't look like that now. But when it's shorter, it, it actually does look like that. Um, once it gets, like, a little long. Hello, Munchlax. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, can I, like, cancel doing that? Oh my god, why am I able to move like this? Yeah. <laughs> Imagine someone, like, you just see someone who just walk in, who's just like... <laughs> oh my god, why am I able to do that? Is this why people complain about, like, the game? Is that what they complain about? Your Sonic now? I'm not gonna get over that. It's so silly. Oh, if you're looking for your bag, didn't you leave it in your room? And grab yourself a hat for the weather as well. You can't go anywhere without a hat. Obviously, you gotta wear a hat. I don't go anywhere without my hat, and I'm not just saying that. Like, as a joke or whatever. Dude, I freaking love the mom in this, in this, uh, in this game. This one. Dude, why am I so fast? Can I get a closer look at her? She's very lovely. Why am I so fast? British people are just faster, right? For some reason. Also, why does our house... Are British homes built like this? They just have a giant entryway from this room to this room. I can understand that. It's the kitchen. Like, why is our house set like a freaking, like a play? Also, it's just black here. Okay, cool. But like, my room doesn't even have a door at least. I'm sleeping in bed. Someone could come over here. They could rob us, come in, and swoosh in over here. Doesn't feel very realistic, but... Hey, those are the Joy-Cons I have! <laughs> I just look right now. Those are my Joy-Cons. Those are the exact same color. Does it know that? It probably knows that. It probably knows what color Joy-Cons you have. The latest video game console is sitting by the telly. Oh, shut up. It's a plus of Pokemon Pikachu. It's super soft to touch. Too bad we don't sell these. God. Why don't they sell Pokemon toys like that, like, or stuff that's, like, in-game? That'd be so cool. What is this? Is this a window or is it reflective? No, it's a mirror. It's just a very non-reflective mirror. It's the bed you went to buy as a family. It's super comfy and it puts you to sleep instantly. This is a really cool room. I would love to have a colorful room like this. Also, do I... Do I just sleep with my mom or something in this, or, or is this her room? It's the only one with a door. Like, there's really no walking in this game, it's just run everywhere. What's the slightest movement I can do? There's no... There, like... <laughs> You're just always in a rush. Alright, is my hat right here? Grab your dad's old bag. It's an old bag, all right? You got a whole suitcase on your back. It's even got the handle. And you got your hat. If your hair doesn't stick out of your hat like that, then you're whack. I do that with my hair. It actually looks like my profile picture. Uh, like a Oswald. 
with like how my hair comes out like that with those three little bits. Not all the time, obviously, but sometimes, majority of the time. Open, X, save. I think I already figured that out. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be a white screen, just like, it's nothing. There's nothing in there yet. Duh. <gasps> I have a fishing rod! Ah! <laughs> oh, I got a Rotom phone. Ooh, there's the whole island area. So everyone knows England's one giant island. Or whatever. Oh, that's cool. You can check the weather and stuff. That's pretty neat. And that's the end of the game. I assume. Cool. I don't know how long I'm going to be doing these episodes for, actually. How long has it been so far? It's been 11 minutes, and I haven't really done anything yet. Alright, well, I guess it's time to go. What is with my hat? I just noticed that. It's like small, and then it bobs out where it's like a ponytail type thing. Huh. Alright, well, let's get out of here. Stop messing around. Hop is waiting for you. Better head outside. Oh, this is a loading screen. Look at this. How do people say this is bad graphics? You guys are just complaining, man. This looks nice. There's so much grass everywhere, man. How could you not like this? Would you? Alright, let's get out of here. Hello, Hop. I don't like you. Ha ha ha! Look at you, Beth Moth. That old bag looks like it could pull you over. At least we know it should hold anything Lee might bring, even if it's as big as a Snorlax. <laughs> a Wooloo? Well, what's it doing there? <laughs> you, uh, you having a good time? Hey, you silly Wooloo, I see what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on that fence. Now you listen. No going past that fence. No. Everyone knows they're a scary wop. Pokemon in slumbering world. Eh. Why didn't you say Wooloo? You're a Pokemon. Now that's taken care of. How about we get it? How about at it? How about it? Let's race. I bet I can make it to your to my house first. What with you lugging that big old bag around? Man, I don't even know where your house is. I guess I'll just follow you. Bad Mero. How come you guys don't say Wooly? Where did he go? <laughs> Power of science is amazing. Now you can battle and trade Pokemon with other people just by walking around. Isn't it super amazing? I guess so. Here we go. Oh, hey, little kid. Mind if I just push you off? Whoa! Hey, Hop was looking for you, you know. No need to get to the next town to find him. And he lives right next door, right? Wait, so where is he? <laughs> Wait, so next door is all the way here? Dang. Look at this wool just rolling around. Rolling around at this speed of sound. I guess he just lives here then. Nothing around here? Cool. Oh, I walk in automatically. I'm so used to pressing a button to go through doors. Hey, Hop, I like your mom, too. I like all the mom. Mom, is he here? There you are, last, Hop. Oh, and you brought along Beth Moss. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed in up in the cupboard? He's not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop, you must learn some patience. He's probably only arrived at the station in West Wedgehurst. And that's where I'm going. You know Lee is hopeless with directions. I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. Oh, will you? Yes, that probably is for the best. You've got to come with Beth Moth. You've still never met my big bro, right? You can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. I'll wait for you out on the route. Alright, well, I guess we're going that way. It feels so awkwardly, because, like... 
Um, <clears throat> because, like, for the longest time, my little brother, right, he would watch Peppa Pig, and, like, I kind of, like, picked up on their British accents a little bit. So, like, hearing the way they talk is so weird. Only remember, wild Pokemon can come out of nowhere if you walk through those patches, those patches of tall grass. I've, I've got Wooloo with me, so I'm ready to battle against wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, so steer clear of tall grass as we go. So what do I do if a Pokemon attacks me? Do I just let it? <laughs> I just let the Pokemon attack me. It's like, come at me, bro. I can take it. Oh, I can't even hear the music too well. But I want to. No wandering in that tall grass till you got a Pokemon of your own, mate. But I want to. Cause like, anyways, um, is he gonna make me talk? He's gonna talk. Okay. Um, I always picked up- hold on, I'm gonna get some water real quick. I always picked up on, like, Peppa Pig, like, the way it talk. And even with my friend, like, he says mate a lot, because he lives in a different part of the world. So, like, I started saying it more and more to the point where I don't even really care too much. Um, ah! You- you can't see me over there! He's just all like, No wandering in the dark grass over there, do you want to my- Shut up! I'll- I'll hit- I'll get you right in the gap, or whatever that. You- you- what, mate? I'm not gonna say no bad words, cause nothing. Oh, we're in Wedsworth already. Small town. Ooh, it's a Charizard. Ugh. Everyone in this town loves Charizard. He was just right here? Hehe. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Oh my god, he's so cool! Oh, I love him so much! Hello, hello, Wedgehurst. Your champion, Leon, is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles you all watch. It's our undefeatable champion, Leon. You and... I was I said Lizard first. You and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope you all carry on training up your Pokemon so you'll never sigh from battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. Where are they? We've been working on... The Who's talking? <laughs> Is it that lady right there? We're on it. We've been working on battle skills just like you taught us to, Lee. Oh, the frame rate dropped a bit there. Too many people on screen. Wait. Who's talking? Okay, I think it's not. Okay. But that Charizard of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on. <laughs> too true. That Charizard is blazing strong. But the other Pokemon uh, can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of challenges to fill the gym battle, and come battle me. My wish is for Galar's trainers to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Luckily, the wind is blowing just perfectly enough for me to look super cool right here. <laughs> I don't know what that was. <laughs> uh, who is that freak? Hop! So, my number one fan in the world has come out all this way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo! That's the sort of sharp eye I kept that kept you on the feet for so long, eh, Lee? And these bright eyes over here. I've got it. You must be Beth, am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm Galar's region greatest ever Pokemon champion, and a massive Charizard fan too. People call me the unbeatable Leon. Wow, they have... Oh wait, okay, never mind. Come on, Lee! You and Beth my bet can beat the both of you back... Ah. Bet I can beat the both of you back home. That hop, always wanting to be the best, isn't he? With a proper rival of his own, I bet he could push himself to become something truly special. Well, everyone, I bid you a farewell for today, but don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Galar have, can have a champion time. Champion time? Whee! Here I go running. I'm more in shape than everyone else around here, because I can run home. But, I mean, it's not like it's that far anyways, so whatever. Isn't that cape, like, really hot? Because it's, like... And yeah, whatever. Come on, Lee, you promised us a present, so out with it. 
You brought Vesmos and me Pokemon, di you did, didn't you? I know you must have. Alright then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's so time, everyone. Here is your Pokemon Pikachu. Not a real Pikachu, it's a, it's a Pokemon Pikachu like the toy. Take good care, good, good care. Grass type Pokemon, Grookey, the fire type Pokemon, Score Bunny, and the water type Pokemon, Subble. Look at him run around. Can you get starters, like, after you've already gotten your starter? Or is it just like one and then like you're stuck with them? Ah! You jerk! There was a type advantage, it hurt! Shut up, Sabo! Look at my stick! Now you're happy again. Alright, everyone. Line up. Which will you choose? Ah, I can't choose. There's so many of them. <laughs> There's so many Pokemon to choose from. I can't pick. Go on. You pick first. I've already got my Wooloo after all. Oh. They're so tiny. I, I felt like they would be a little bit bigger, but they feel so tiny. Maybe just the camera. Anyways, I'm picking Sobble. Are they going to ask? That's the water type. Sobble. It adapts to anything. As surly as water flows. Going with the water type Pokemon Sobble? Yes. Not even like a little are you sir or anything. Just like, alright. Hmm. Dang. A nickname. Um. Uh, actually, Han. Wait, no! I, I wanted to name him! No! Ah, uh, I wanted to name him! So it'll be Sobble for you. Nice one. And I'll go with Score Bunny. You're mine. Just like yanks him. Just like, come here! Heh <laughs> heh. I'll be aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. You and I, you and I will have some serious training to do. You know, I don't even care. It's the same, it's, it's basically said the same thing, okay? I bet you will be, Hop. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you and Bethmop. So the two of you can battle and train and grow stronger. To try and teach, to, to try and reach me. I thought you were going to say teach me. I was like, why would we teach you? <laughs> Grookey will just, he, he's a good boy. He'll, he'll be here. <laughs> just like kick him. <laughs> and you'll come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but a real strong and real kind too. Oh, it's the mothers we both... Uh, um. <laughs> Alright, enough of all this trainer nonsense for one night. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon, and let's all eat. What are they eating? They're so tiny. Whoa! Those things are huge. Got kebabs. Looked like he was ready to stab someone with just like... It's like, oh yeah, so neither of us chose Grookey, so I guess he's going to the kebab next. You spent the whole night with your new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two getting along all right? Understanding one another? Maybe even built a bit of love? Of course I have, Lee. I loved him all night long. <laughs> Bethmod's made fast friends with his Sobble, too. Then listen up, new trainers. Believe in, your fr believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday you might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champion. What are you looking at him? Wait, what are you looking at him for, Lee? I'm the one who'll be coming to challenge you. If you think Bethmon might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my first rival. But I'm not playing to lose to him and miss out on my chance to beat the unbeatable champion. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer. Wow! <laughs> Okay, wow. Screw you. Proper trainers raise their Pokemon to be first-rate battle, too. Oh, 
And you think you're worthy of calling yourself a proper trainer already, Hop? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Ha! Huh. Let's see how you handle yourself in battle against your friend if he's up for it. What do you say? Willing to ready? Wait. Willing and ready to take Hop on on your first Pokemon battle of your life? Nah. <laughs> Believe in your partner, Pokemon, and care for them too, with all your heart. Do those two things, and I'm certain you'll learn choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And most importantly, to have a champion time battling with them. Here we go. Looks like everyone's on board, Pokemon and trainers alike. Then let's do this. I've watched every match that Lee's ever had. I'm ready. I've read every book and magazine left behind and at home too. I know exactly what to do in order to win. Oh really? This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get your Pokemon and I'm gonna kick him into the lake. Here we go. All right, I got my Sobble. I wanted to name him something. Can we name him stuff later? A Pokemon battle it is, then. I've got two partners with me. Oh, that's, that's not fair. You got Wooloo and you got, you got Score Bunny. I don't, got my, I don't have anything in my bag yet. Oh, I have a Poston. That's nice. Where did I get it? <laughs> Run! <laughs> uh... They're both normal types, so... Whatever. Pound it is. Pam! Yeah! Wow, that did nothing. You've had your Wooloo for- How is your Wooloo less- Okay. Whatever. I mean, it's- this is just all we're doing for right now. Just pressing A for a bit. It's- it's a- like a practice thing. Like, why is your Wooloo a lower level than the starter Pokemon? Why didn't you just use your starter? Well, I mean, technically you do have your starter, so then you can just use him afterwards. You have Score Bunny. Oh wait, I win? Do I win already? What about Score Bunny? Yeah, I got Water Gun. It's not over yet. I've added another trusty ally to my team. Okay, so he is gonna do Score Bunny. <clears throat> All right. Good. Do Water Gun because it's a type advantage, because I know about type advantages. Oh, is he going to ask me about that? Take this! It's super effective. Did you already know about type advantages? I mean, I don't think it takes a genius to think, hey, water puts out fire, use a water looking type attack. I mean, a Water Gun, use Water Gun against a fire type. I mean... Rawr. You know, now I think about it, I guess if I chose Score Bunny, he would have chose, uh, chose Grookey then. So then he would have been like, do you already know about the type advantages? Whoa. And that's how I beat his level 5 Pokemon. Wow, this is very easy to see what they're trying to do here. I'm already at 7. Fantastic. And your Wooloo is at 3. Did you ever train with him or anything? Could have sworn he said that he trained him at least once or something. Ah, uh, you beat my my two Pokemon with her one? You and that Sobble are too much. You got 400 Pokemon monies for winning. Meow. Well, that was a sock. I guess I know why I, Lee thought I... Wait, thought he could give Pokemon... Bleh! Well, that was a sock. Guess I know why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon, too. You and your Pokemon are all fought hard. Made me almost want to let out my Charizard and join in on the whole fun. Good effort out there, Sobble. Why don't you get all sorted? And you. You've got real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask of you. Be a rival to Hop, would you? Push him and make both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. I don't need this chump. <laughs> you already see me in battle. Battle now, Lee. So come on, you've got to let me take, uh, take on the Pokemon. You couldn't even beat me. This is the first battle of my life, and I beat you with one Pokemon against your two. You join the gym challenge. 
You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in all the Gala region? Not putting the cart before the rapid dash there, little brother. If that's really what you want to do, you have two. Wait. You two have a whole lot. Wait, you two have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Bethmoth. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helps him learn of the things all about Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data. You know, it's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. All right, right, we get it. Pokedex is then. We're on it. Looks like we're off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, Bethmod. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer like you needs. I'll let the professor know what to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokedex will be nothing. Just another page in the tale of my legend. You'd probably better go tell your mom that we're heading out, though. So. Alright, they're just gone. Cool, when do we save? Can we just save anywhere? It's been like 30 minutes already. So I guess I'll save right here then. Good as time as ever. 27 minutes and we're already like 31 minutes in. Alright. Cool. Alright. So thanks guys for watching. This has been episode 1 of Pokemon Sword. Yeah, strike a pose. Bam. Alright. This seems really fun so far. I mean, we just got through the basics. I'm sure we all kind of expected that. So, yeah. Like, comment, subscribe as always, guys. Until the next video, see you guys.